What's poppin' y'all? It's your girl Team Stacy, and welcome to my Hot Girl Summer Series, where in this series, I'll show you guys how to become a hot girl in the most affordable and the most bad B way, period. So as you guys see, today we achieved this beautiful cheetah print red bottom blinged out nails, and I would not be able to achieve this without this company sponsoring this video. Later on in the video, I'll talk more about them, but can we get into it? Get into it, y'all see that? Mm -hmm. These are press on, no acrylic, no tools needed. Well, no like drills and stuff. But anyways, let's go ahead and get onto the video. Alrighty guys, so first thing I want to do is give a special thanks to Nail Attic. Nail Attic is sponsoring this video today. They sent me these beautiful shades. They sent me this base coat that I'm showing you guys here. They sent me this top coat. These are both clear and they drag very glossy. They also sent me this beautiful yellow. It gives me like a mimosa vibe shade. You know, we're going to have that this summer. Um, they also sent me this beautiful like midnight blue. And the star of the show, they sent me Sugar Magnolia, which is this beautiful pink. So these three, Top Base and Sugar Magnolia, are what we're using for this tutorial today. So I also want to show you guys some other things that I'm using. Thank you to my homegirl Tia for putting me on to these false nails that I got from Amazon. They are beautiful coffee shape nails and I literally love them they are so strong and so sturdy and everything I'm using will be linked down below so as you guys see I will be doing the extendo clip I'm gonna show you guys how to extend your nails and make them extra long versus just having them the standard size you can do the standard size but I'm gonna show you guys both ways so let's get into the tools that we're using so first thing I have here is a nail file then I'm gonna have some t some scissors you can use scissors or nail clippers which whichever one you have then I have some tweezers to pick up the diamonds some nail glue and these diamonds I have here, I got them from Walmart. The bigger ones are from Walmart and the tiny ones that I have on my other hand, those are from the hair store. And then I also use a tiny paintbrush to do some detail work. You're also going to need 91 or 70% alcohol, whichever one you have laying around your house some napkins and this is also a uv light from a nail attic so if you're using gel you will need a uv light of course so first thing i'm going to do is file down my nails you want to file down your nails to get that nice abrasive grit something for the glue to stick onto so we're just going to file down you know our nails then i'm going to push back my cuticles y'all i don't know nothing about no cuticles okay so if you are a nail tech watching this please don't comment me in the comments but i'm just doing what i see other girls do you know monkeys let me stop but i'm just pushing back my cuticles I don't know much about it but yeah you could do that then you want to wipe off your nails with the alcohol I use 91% I'm just gonna wipe down my natural nail and also the false nail. now you can use nail glue for this but I did want to try something new I'm gonna use nails addicts base their base and I'm gonna put that on my natural nail and also the false nail and stick it on to my nail and after that, I'm going to flip my UV lamp over and I'm going to just, you know, put my nail under there for 60 seconds and just hold that in place. Now, you don't have to use this, but I did feel like it was going to be stronger. So that's why I did this. But like I said, you can opt out to use nail glue. After the 60 seconds, this is what my nail is looking like and it looks fire already. So I know I told y'all we extending it and y'all probably like, why are you cutting it if you extending it? But it's all gonna make sense. Just follow your girl, Team Stacy. I got you this summer. So what you wanna do is file that down after you cut the nail. You wanna cut the nail very short. And this is really just so we can have something for our extended nail to blend into and not just your natural nail. You'll understand what I'm saying when the video keeps going, okay? So I just filed everything down. Now I'm going in with nail glue on the false nail and also the other false nail. And I'm just sticking it on. And now this is where the extension has occurred, okay? We have now an extendo nail, period. And I'm just wiping off any excess um, nail glue that came out through the sides. So I'm gonna show you guys a comparison of what the nails will look like if you did not extend it. If you extend it in the first clip, you see that it's very natural, short, and now with the extendo, it's way longer. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to file down where you have that, that line. You see that line of demarcation where it shows you? We're gonna file that down. I lost the clip when I was actually filing, but I'm gonna show you guys on the next nail one more time, all the steps all over again. But as you guys see, it's very smooth. I filed it down perfectly, no drill, just a nail file. And then I also shape the sides, but that's completely optional. I'm just being, you know, real extra for the summer, period. So here I'm doing it again. First, I'm gonna file down my natural now, and I'm starting with my, you know, index finger. I'm gonna go ahead and file down my natural now. 
And then I'm gonna push back my cuticles again. Wipe down my natural nail with 91% alcohol and also the false nail. You can use nail glue or you can use a base coat, but I'm going in with the base coat. I'm gonna put that on my natural nail. And then also put that on the false nail as you can see. And then I'm going to put my hand on the UV light and let that sit for 60 seconds. And then I also flip it over and let it sit for an additional 60 seconds. And like I said, next we're gonna do is cut the nail that we just put down. We're going to cut it to a nice, you know, nice length, short, very natural looking, and we're gonna shape it, file it, make sure it's nice, even, shape the size, just do your thing. And now I put glue on my false nail that's on my finger and also the other nail and I'm just sticking them together. And now we created another extendo nail. Here we, period. <laughs> and now I'm just showing you guys how I file um, that line of demarcation that's gonna be between the two nails. I just, I usually count to about 10 seconds and I file it down. Be very mindful, stop in between every five seconds just to make sure it's getting smooth. Once it's smooth, you don't wanna keep filing down the same area because it's gonna get too weak and too thin and it can pop off. So you wanna smooth it where there's no line, but you don't wanna go too crazy where the nail can just break because it's too weak. So I did the rest of my nails off camera and this is how they look, they're so fire. And now I'm gonna go back in with Nail Addicts Base. I love their base coat, I feel like it dries so well, super glossy, so thick, and I just love that. And I feel like without Nail Addict, these nails would not have came out how they came. I feel like they give the appearance that they have acrylic because Nail Addicts products are so thick and they dry so well that it makes the nails even stronger. Like, I'll make y'all hear right now. That's my nails, y'all. That's my nails so strong, like there's no popping going on right now. So I'm going back in after I applied the base and I'm just putting it under the UV lamp. I believe they sent me the mini one, which I do like, but I am gonna go ahead and purchase with my own money the bigger one because I felt like it was a little too small. But yeah, I'm just texting back my peoples, my people them. But um, now we're gonna go in with the star of the show, Sugar Magnolia. This color is so pretty, it's a mauve pink and I literally love it. When I saw it in that box, I had to grab it and we had to bring it to the corals, okay? So I'm just gonna put a layer of the nail polish on my nails. You don't have to be too neat because this is just the first coat, but don't go too crazy and get messy because you don't wanna make it harder for yourself to clean up later. So I'm just applying a nice layer of my first coat. And while I'm doing that, let me go ahead and talk to you guys about these polishes. All right, guys, so Nail Attic was so nice to give us 45% off if you use my promo code STACY when you are shopping with them. They have a big website full of things that you guys most likely will love because I fell in love. I couldn't even choose what I wanted from them. You guys can choose from whatever colors you guys want to use for the summer or for whenever. Honestly, right now we're in a hot girl summer series. I keep saying summer, but this video is timeless and this is for whenever you want to shop with nail addicts so like i said down below i will list all the colors that i use today all the products that i use today um all the links for nail addicts will be listed down below and you guys can also just check them out All right guys, so after I applied a top coat, I cured it for 60 seconds, and now we're gonna go ahead and get into the details of this look. So what you wanna do is you wanna grab any hot pink, doesn't matter which one you grab, you wanna grab a hot pink and make some polka dots on your nails. So I just made some polka dots all over my fingers. And your nail should now look like this. And I did go ahead and cure it, but this wasn't gel, so I didn't have to. But now I'm gonna take a black um, 
a black nail polish you can use any black nail polish that you have and I'm also gonna take the paintbrush that I showed you guys earlier this is just a fine paintbrush so I can go in there and really do detail work on my nails so it is a little blurry but I did want to show you guys all you do around the polka dots is you want to make C shapes so you want to make one C on one side and then a C on the other side and that's it you can close it and make a full circle around it but the thing about um, cheetah spots is none looks the exact same they're all over the place they're all different so it, that's the best thing about this thing so after I made the little seeds I just put black dots all over as you guys can see I'm just putting dots all over and that's pretty much it I did that on my whole hand and it looks fire as you guys can see you can stop there and you know leave it like that but you know I'm extra it's summer we are taking everything to another level we're not staying where we are okay so you know i had to add some diamonds we're gonna bling it out so i just added diamonds on the um outer portion of my nails near my cuticles and then on my my ring my middle finger as you can see i did just a straight line full of diamonds if you guys want a diamond tutorial i will go ahead and do some more nails and bling it out um but for this i didn't feel like i really needed to do a tutorial on that but if you guys want it in my next video you're gonna see nail attic in my next video again anyways and i will love to show you guys how I put diamonds on there as well um this is optional as well like i said i'm being extra i'm doing you know just extra steps on here what i'm doing is i'm just applying a red polish under and those are called red bottoms i'm gonna go ahead and comment down below the youtuber that inspired me to do this look she's so sweet i love the video and that's what really inspired me to do this look so shout out to her i can't remember her name but it will be down below um after i did go ahead and do the red bottoms i just took nail addicts top coat and i put that also on top of the red that we just applied and then i cured that and these are the final results of these nails i am so surprised i went on instagram and i posted these nails and i got so many comments and so many people could not believe that i did this and let me tell you if it wasn't for no addict but <laughs> this would not have happened i'm so grateful and i love it so much and i just can't wait to bring you guys more tutorials make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and comment down below other style that you guys would like for me to do i'm definitely going to start doing more nail tutorials on my page um but like i said subscribe to my channel and make sure you guys keep up with my hot girl summer series i will be showing you guys how to become a hot girl um in the most affordable and the most baddie way possible i love you guys so much thank you so much for tapping in all the way to the end of this video um if you made it to this part of the video go ahead and comment down a cheetah and i will know that you are gang and you made it to the end i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next video Mwah. bye guys